back again. Third hour of recording today. This will be episode six of uh, our Midway region. Uh, specifically, we're in the city of Cliffside. As you can see, our Omega factories are doing well. We're pumping out lots of drones. Everything's coming along swimmingly for now. Our next goal here is to upgrade our trading HQ and our electronics HQ so we can start making TVs, computers, and um, want to be able to, well, you know, export them from the trade port. It would be super helpful. As well as importing uh, plastic through the trade port as well. <laughs> Sorry, I... My wife keeps texting me while I'm streaming. Take, two, take a few minutes off, she doesn't text me, and she does right when I start up. <laughs> Apparently it's one of my friend's birthday today, and I didn't even know it, so I gotta wish him a happy birthday here. Wish him a happy birthday. Not enough workers, unskilled workers. Got pretty good education. I'm not sure why he wasn't able to get skilled workers, but okay. How are we doing on profits here? So close. I think what we're gonna do is our little trick to get us over the uh, over the hurdle. We're gonna stop exporting. Uh, oops, I'm gonna keep taking those. We're gonna stop exporting processors. Ah, nice. And then as soon as we have them piled up, we'll export them all. If you're watching live, welcome back to the chat, or to the, the stream, whatever. <laughs> Doing a lot of recording today, so I wanted to break it up into kind of hour-long chunks. <clears throat> Makes the episodes nice for YouTube. Makes the highlights okay for Twitch. I finally did a lot of work on my audio today and got the game sound working. I think I got my microphone volume balanced pretty well, so hopefully that is coming across better. I think we're going to take time to squeeze in some more stuff in this area. So let's dezone it. Bulldoze that block. Cause I want to cram. I know that at least two high density buildings can fit there, so I want to. I want to make sure they get crammed in there correctly. It should yeah, we should be able to fit high wealth on both of those. Now there's one and the other one, there we go. The other one will pop up. <laughs> Once we hit midnight here, we'll 
start exporting our uh, processors again so that everything counts towards that towards the next day. And then that should bump us over hopefully both of these, our 2 million and our, our 1.5 million mark. Hopefully. Abandonment, that's great. Oh, we need to. Oh, man. <laughs> we need to turn these on. I forgot about Omega. It, uh, it does a lot of trash. A lot of trash. In fact, I can probably put another one of those on. We need to make sure we burn off all that garbage. <laughs> there we go. And hopefully by tomorrow morning... Oh, we need to start selling these again. Hopefully by tomorrow morning, this will be empty. Tomorrow morning game time. This will be empty. If not... I'm gonna need to figure out something else. Because it looks like it's filling up really easily right now. We may have to have a second garbage dump in the in the air this city. In fact, what we may need to do is some recycling in this city. Just simply so that there's less garbage. We'll put this right here. And I'm going to do two plastics and two alloys, since that's basically what we're using. Plastic and alloy. I won't go fit me out here. Use up some of this area. I think four is good for now. So hopefully now we'll be able to mitigate some of this trash, because there is just so much. I still know they're going to throw away a lot as far as Omega goes. Uh, it just creates so much trash, but what are you going to do, you know? Something was blinking at me for down here, and I really don't know what it was. Because everything was upgraded as far as I can. Or, you know, everything that I want to pop is popped, and everything's upgraded as I can. So. Man, it's hard to believe this. I can't burn off the trash fast enough. Mmm, and now we have a lot more injury. 
batteries too. So let's put those drone things down here. Help keep them from dying. I'm gonna put another patient's room in. And put a couple of these. We'll also put some wellness centers in. Maybe just two. Our other things. Good on burning. Good on crime. I haven't touched this police station for a long time, so I'm happy with it. Hey, there's our HQ upgrade. I think actually what we need to do is move this HQ just a little bit. Let's pause this. And then we're going to extend this road so that we have another place for things. We're going to bring this up here. And then we can put the electronics HQ back down. Maybe we should just do it all on this side. Yeah, I think that would look actually pretty good. Consumer Electronics Factory right in here. Which is going to be all for TVs. those any little stragglers here. And I think what we'll actually do is take this one out, I take these two out, and move them right over here if I can. Oh, maybe I can't fit them. Well, that was the plan, so I guess they're just going to go right where they were. And this doesn't need out. need to put a TV lot in. And actually, let's move that TV lot. I want it back there. A little bit more room up front here. I'm debating putting a second trade port in, but I don't know that I need to. Because I would just need somewhere for plastic and TV, and that's not a uh, plastic and computer, and that's not that big of a deal. Because if nothing else, we can, you know, make half of this lot actually processors. Because we're not worried about process selling so many processors.
Alright, now it seems to be using the, or, you know, burning up the garbage a little bit better. I was hoping it was turning up the garbage a little better, but we still seem to be using a lot of it. Hopefully tomorrow people will recycle more, or today now in the game, people will recycle a little bit more. soon be finally burning some of that stuff down. Although we got a bunch coming in here. Hmm, maybe not that much. Alright. So that's getting better. Upgrade our trade HQ. Put in the petroleum division. It's gonna go right here. This processor plant and this processor storage block. We're gonna put the computer storage or the we'll put the plastic one up there because it's gonna be a lot of plastic to import. We want to make sure we don't run out. We will import the plastic here. Export the plastic there. Stop taking the local deliveries of it. And I think we can put one of our processors back in here. I know I've moved this around a couple times. Uh, I just depends on what I need at the time. And since we're using our processors as well, it'll help to uh, keep them from being exported quite as quickly because we'll be using them within the city here. We do want to export our TVs. And I kind of want to put in one more plant, a computer plant. I'm not sure where though yet. Let me think for a minute. We could put it up in this corner with the, uh, the trade port. I don't think I'm going to do a second trade port. It doesn't seem to make a lot of sense, because uh, I'm just going to need to fill in one one or two little things here and there. Um, yeah, I don't think we're going to do a second trade port. So I think maybe, yeah, maybe we will put our processor plant up there. Or our, excuse me, our... our uh, television factory plant. <laughs> I was hoping I could turn it sideways there, but it just doesn't seem like it's going to fit.
Dezone this now. Just like we can remove the zoning from here and from there. small on power. Might be time to add another one on. Another power plant. That all seems to be going along swimmingly. There's some good amount of drones, a good amount of Omega. have some slow Omega deliveries for the moment. We may have to add another Omega factory sometime soon, but not yet. I think the city is coming out looking very nice so far, though. Of course, I'm a little biased there. It is my city. I did make it. Otherwise, this city is getting fairly close to complete. I think the last thing we're going to do with this city is try to uh, make the Arcology with it. Because once we have the Arcology there, it'll be very easy to build the other two cities and not worry about how much population they have. Uh, the other two cities on this particular island of this particular region. moment I'm just trying to make sure everything is running smooth.
you guys have any thoughts or questions, obviously leave me, you know, let me know in the stream or if you're watching After the Fact on YouTube, just uh, leave me a comment. I will read them, I promise. I don't promise to do anything about it, but I'll read them. What is needing to be bulldozed? Building fire. Okay. Where's our rubble? Is that also due to building fire? Unskilled workers. Okay. I'm not sure why we have unskilled workers. They're very educated. But we're now making over a million a month. Which I believe is 24 hours in this game. Which means I think we can afford to do our process or our TVs to the ecology. Let's go to the great work site, tell it to build it. It'll take a little bit. And then we'll start exporting stuff. And then while we're exporting, I think I'll do a little fine-tuning on this city. And hopefully we'll end this episode with the Arcology being constructed. If all goes well. Waiting for that great works approval. Which storage is full? Processors, okay. That I'm fine with. We can totally have a full processor storage, but it just needs to be picked up and taken out. Uh, I live above a bar, <clears throat> and I can hear it, but I'm sure you, I, I don't think you, any room can. <laughs> They've started playing music today. I suppose it's almost 4 o'clock on a Saturday, that's fine. But it's always just so loud. So I hope it doesn't transfer through to the stream. Because um, all, all you would hear is just stupid bass, thump, thump, thump. <laughs> Oh, now that we have the Commerce Division, I almost forgot. We can put uh, VTOL landers over here.
which will help to export stuff. And if, <laughs> if it works, I don't know, I've, I've always hesitant to do that. In the past, I've had it work perfect for these VTOL liners for the Omega Factory. Works great. More recently, though, in the last two cities I've built that I've tried to put them on, they stop working. I don't know when, and I'm not sure why, but the VTOL landers come in and don't drop anything off. You can see them come in, but no nothing goes into the Omega Factory, so I'm not entirely sure why they're, they're being like that. But, let's try it. Let's do one to start with. And we'll stop importing over here. We'll just start using them locally. And tell this one, yes, except from global market. Because if we can get that to work, then we can move the two things over here at the trade depot over here to the trade port, and we'll be all good to go with that. I, every major thing that we do for, for import and export going through the trade port. Hey, Space Center's done researching. I suppose we can research something else here. Maybe I'll use wind power at another city, so let's do that one. There it is. stuff over there. So until we use that up I don't see I don't think we'll see it coming in, but we'll wait. Oh hey there we go. Our ecology is approved, so let's start exporting our TVs. Which we should have. Alright, so I have it there. We switched it to use locally, right? Yep, okay. Not enough workers. I'm working on that. Ecologies do tend to take a long time, so I don't know if we'll get it done in this episode. I hope so. Deleting some of these little filler, filler pieces. Maybe we can get some higher density stuff in there. But we still have an enormous demand for workers. So I think we're also going to put in a mega tower. Let's see here. Mega tower is gonna fit. It'll definitely fit back here. And I think it'd be good to have it exit onto this road. Hmm. 
and then maybe join up there. I'm not sure. Here yet. Let's try this. <clears throat> we demolish this. I'll do that. Yeah, I'll move the mayor's house here. Actually, I'll move it right down here because it's not. Eh. Yeah, let's just move it there because nothing's gonna freaking grow there. <laughs> It's just the wrong size. Oh, and of course it's the wrong size for the mayor's mansion, too. How about right there? Yeah? Yeah, right there. And then, we need to dezone the inside here. And demolish the buildings. How are we doing on trash? Trash is doing a lot better now. Keeping up with the garbage, so we'll be able to put this tower in no problem. I'm totally keeping up with recyclables too, which is excellent. I kind of want to put a special entrance or exit to the industrial section just for this tower. I'm not sure if it'll work the way I intend. Face it that way. And we need to... Next side here. And then I'd like to maybe... Hmm. If I could bring this up here somewhere... Mind you, I don't know where yet. Let's see. Can I bring it over here? I might have to actually go out just a little bit. See, I could bring it all the way out here. And since I'm not going to have another anything for my, um, for my electronics HQ, I think that might be a good idea. I want the curve mode, though. Because I'd like to... I'd like to come out and attach here somewhere. Maybe I'll need to, uh... Okay, let's do this. I'm just making a corner to this road and I want it to be even. And then I think we can demolish this one. We might actually have to like kind of loop this around so that it can connect correctly, because I think we're actually going to try to connect it right back here along the, along there. So let's see if we can get this to go. Okay. Just one click and that gives us our ton. Wow, that worked out much better than I had imagined. Alright. Works for me. Oh, we have another entrance and exit up there, as well as down here. So we have an entrance at each corner, basically, to our industrial area. Hopefully spreading out that traffic. 
I think we're going to put a park at the base of this just to ensure everybody's happy. It will also serve as a park for that area as well. And I think that will uh, upgrade some of this to low uh, to, to medium wealth as well because. Yeah. Provides a little bit of wealth there. I'm debating whether to put a low wealth. Here, let's see how many low wealth shoppers we have because we might take out some of this commercial and just put more residential in down here. Let's see what's going on with that. Yeah, let's take out all the low wealth shops. everything over here. D zone on that. I think I'm just gonna I'm not even gonna put a residential back in there. And this. I think all the other commercial that we have is all medium. Meaning that when we put a mall in here, that'll be the only place for people to shop for low wealth in the city. So they better friggin' shop there. <laughs> and I think malls work better at the lowest levels. Although I'm not positive on that. I haven't done enough testing. Okay, yeah, we've used that up in there, and below here, let's see if something comes in. Alright, so it seems to be working. We'll put another one on. And then we can take out these here. And we'll replace them with um, TV or with uh, processor and computers. Oh, that's right. I'm gonna need to bulldoze these as well in order to make it fit. We'll still export processors and export computers. I believe we can just demolish this. Yes. Let's actually not demolish it. Let's turn it off because I think we're gonna 
let's not even turn it off. Let's actually just replace everything there with um, metal because we're going to import metal for the uh, our power. I do read my chat, Nathan. Thank I saw you followed me earlier. Thank you. Sometimes I'm a little bit slow reading my chat because I get involved in the game, but I do look at it. I'm also on my dashboard rather than my channel, so I'm not sure what the timeline difference is there, if one comes up quicker than the other, so... I think this has worked fine for me so far, so I'll keep doing that. should start taking care of our full plant here. There we go. And this should be getting plenty from its from its VTOLs. At least it better be. I don't understand why they stop working sometimes. See there, I just watched two oil come in, drop nothing off. Son of a... Alright. We're just gonna have to use this one. I'll leave the two metals. We're still gonna do that, and then we'll do the uh, ore and oil. I don't, I don't understand why the VTOLs stop working. It's the stupidest thing in the world. Import, import. I'm also gonna just get rid of those because they don't work. So we may lose a few factories because we're going to be out of Omega for a minute here. stuff here. We're most of the way done with TVs. Now that we've started getting metal, let's go ahead and export our metal as well. Oh, I guess we're halfway done with the TVs. to rezone these for residential. Hmm, tall building. <laughs> it's top heavy. Uh, this region is uh, called Horizon Archipelago, normally. I, I changed it to Midway. In fact, I'll give you a little overview here. It's this region. It's got kind of three main islands. It's got an island here. Oops. An island over here. 
and an island back here. And we're going to do, uh, I'm actually going to fill out all of them by the end of this whole series, so it's maybe like a 500 part series, but we'll see how long it takes. Oh, yeah. Alright, going good. How's the small level doing? Doing well. I wonder if I should make a second mall level there. In fact, I think I will. Waste a little bit of money there, but that's okay. Basically, the mall is like a two-level mall. That would be pretty cool, hopefully. And the rest of the tower will fill up with uh, residential. I'm slowly creeping up on happiness. Commercial's not so happy at the moment, but I'm, I'm pretty sure they're going to get a lot more happy soon. Starting to get a lot of agents in the city. You can see a little bit of choppiness when I turn the frame or something. There we go. Now we'll start adding on apartment levels. I think between this mega tower and the arcology, we'll have plenty of population for the city. Maybe we'll make this stream a little bit longer than an hour, just because I would like to finish building this uh, this mega tower and such. I think these mall levels don't really report themselves correctly to this. It just it seems like when there's demand here, they're actually you shouldn't actually put a, a mall level in because then it'll go out of business. I'm not really sure though. Everything else coming along. Making most of our garbage. Or our, our recycling, rather. We're doing okay there still. And while there seems to be a lot of cars on the road, much of this flows pretty well. Everything keeps moving. 
Except right here, it's pretty bad. <laughs> Not enough Omega. Not enough Omega. So we may need to make another Omega factory here. Oh, uh, that still needs oil. We are importing it. Maybe we're just not getting it quickly enough. So we'll just have one metal lot. And we'll do two oil lots. on fire still. Doing good on health. Well, one crime, but that's okay. We did just add a large chunk of population to the city, so I don't think these guys have even had a chance to go to school yet. Most of them anyway. Final apartment level. And what should we do as a top? This tower is going to make money as it is. Did we never fix our power problem? We were having a power problem earlier. Yeah, we're pretty low on power, so let's let's do that one. Oh my god, I totally forgot about that. It's alright though. We'll put the power plant topper on, or the solar power topper on it. That'll work perfectly. There we go. Plenty of extra power. Still low on oil there. I don't understand why. Could it be traffic? It could just be the traffic, I guess. Causing the backup and making it, yeah, because there's a couple oil ones here stuck. But there's only a little bit of oil in there, though. The city's running pretty good, if I do say so myself. And I think putting these malls at the lower levels helps. Parks as well, they seem to be able to get to the parks better that way. So that brought us up to 162,000 people in the city.
Hmm, there's no deaths, but it was red for a minute there. We should probably turn off turning me sending metal to the ecology. Sending more than one thing at a time just kills the amount of, <laughs> of stuff that you have. Like, the amount of trucks, you know. They're always stuck somewhere, it seems like. Yeah, because you can see there's a whole bunch of trucks over here. Just waiting to get in there. And there they all finally go in, come out. Yeah. I think maybe that was part of our problem with oil and omega, is that we we were trying to export too much to the arcology at once. So maybe we'll just complete process or complete um, TVs to the arcology, and we'll call this stream a day. And of course, I w I'm going to stream for one more hour after this one, um, and maybe some more tonight. But for for now, that's fine. Um, it's true for one more hour after after this one, so if you're watching live, feel free to stay tuned. I'll stop the stream for just a minute, export the video to YouTube, and then I'll start the stream up again. But, I would definitely want to finish these TVs first. Yeah, I've got quite a bit of traffic there. I'm wondering if I shouldn't take this out. Like, they, they probably shouldn't attach there. <laughs> yeah, that should help out a little bit with traffic there. And I think, too, we need to take the ends of this road and turn it to the low density. There's too much through traffic that's being stopped. This whole thing can go to low density. Oh, there's low density. This can go to low density. And this can go to low density. It should help the through traffic a bit more. Oh, and same with these. Maybe this one just needs to be low, and the rest of these should be medium in the middle. Let's do it that way. Because otherwise they seem to get take too long getting off of the street. Pretty heavy on traffic pretty much all the time now. It's just there's a lot of people in the city, there's not a lot of road. Should be, you know, a lot of them should be using the bus, but not necessarily. Oh, hey. Let's put in, let's put in the School of Medicine. It just generally helps, uh, helps the, uh, the people live longer in the city, and it adds the ability to do the research project. 
Which is nice, because it helps heal injured people faster. And now we're starting to really rake in the money. We got four million, no problem now. Good on power now. Great on water. Okay on sewage. In fact, maybe we'll just do this here. Because I want to have all seven of those dropped on there. Sounds like they're playing some Daft Punk down at the bar below me. There, see so that'll work better. Treating city sewage. So close on these televisions, just a little bit longer to go. Everything else is looking pretty okay here. Hmm. I think because of our traffic, we're not doing so good there. Kind of watching traffic, seeing what I can do to help improve things later on. Not sure yet. Definitely need to add another oops. Another recycling truck and another garbage truck. Hmm. 
can try to add another garbage thing on here. Hey, there we go, that should work. At least one more, maybe even two. Ah, not quite two. Here, have I extend this? No, not quite two. Do you have any tips on how to deal with traffic? Um, <clears throat> there's a, there's several ways to deal with traffic. One of the best, if you have the expansion and you want to do it in that particular city, is Maglev. Maglev it gets people there super fast. Um, and each one of the Maglev stations that you put down puts out like two or three of the Maglev trains. So, like I said, it moves people around the city super, super fast. You can also do uh, interchanges between highways, you know, uh, try to avoid four-way intersections, that's a pretty standard one. Um, you can do interchanges, uh, kind of like I've done here. Um, this one, I didn't mind doing a four-way uh, four intersection here because uh, a couple reasons. One, almost nobody goes on this road. Um, m more people take a right there. And two, both of these parts that intersect this highway are low-density roads, meaning that they have a stop sign here and there's no stoplight going this way. So they can, people can get through there a lot faster. I still have some traffic in this city, um, just because I, I didn't really. I've kind of stuck to more high, uh, one way or more um, high density roads rather than avenues. I kind of did one avenue through the middle of the city, and, and that was about it. But um, I could have done it a little bit better. But I didn't plan this city to be that high of a population. I didn't realize I was going to need that much population <laughs> for this city. So it's yeah, it's kind of my fault. But yeah, mass transit, uh, you know, buses are good. Trains, if you can make it work well, you can put, you know, a train on one side of your city and a train on the other side of the city, they'll use it to commute within the city. So, um, it, it, if you can make it work in, 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 depending on the way your city is set up, it, it can really help that way too. I am going to refill my cup of coffee while this is, uh, going, so I'll be right back. And I have returned with coffee. Too bad I can't pour some for you over the internet, but it doesn't work that way. Now see, this one I may need to change, I need, may need to change parts of these to medium density because they're not exiting well enough. Although they are still getting backed up down here. I'm not sure yet. But we're making about a thousand an hour on our mega tower. Which isn't, you know, amazing, but it's good. We're almost done with our televisions. Let's 
see where they are over there. Oh, none of them are over there. Oh, they're all trying to come back in to pick up more TVs. Which there's not that many, but there's a few. Once we have the arcology constructed, we'll probably do another, uh, my stream after this one. I'm actually going to take a little bit of a, uh, well, I'm going to do a sh probably a shorter stream after this one. About a half hour, maybe an hour, we'll see. In fact, we'll call it a stream for now. So go ahead and follow me on, on Twitch if you enjoy watching me live. If you want to watch after the fact, I put my stuff up on YouTube, which is actually what I'm about to do. So you can go ahead and leave me a comment there, too, if you have any, anything to say about the city. I'm going to um, publish this to YouTube, and I will be right back, stream. <laughs>